James Fisher was initially asked to design the truck in a specific way because it was very much a specialist requirement from the truck. We wanted to take a container type tipper truck and put a base onto it. So the container that sits on the back of it would extend out. They would have a container that is preloaded with some type of waste product. Automatic twist locks would lock, securing the container to the truck. Once it reaches the tipping site, place out the stabilizing arms. The bed would extend out. Then you could tip the truck. And once it got to 20 degrees off center, the little arms would open up, allowing the doors on the container to automatically open. Once it reached a 50 degree tipping point, that would be the maximum tipping point allowable. If you should breach that for any reason and you hit a 60%, then uh, alarms would go off. Once you'd tip the truck and made sure that all the uh, waste material had exited the container, you would tip the container back to level. As you reach the 20 degree level, the doors would automatically close again. The door closing mechanism, which is another facility on it, would extend and close the doors for you. and you could operate this truck from either internal controls within the truck or external controls via this box. Then the, the bed would retract to its home position and you could pick the hydraulic legs up, drive away. <laughs>